Glenavon under 13s and Dungannon Youth under 13s kicked off in the second round of the Knockout Cup. Glenavon in the blue and Dungannon in the yellow. Dungannon started strongly and opened the scoring in style when this long range effort from Dara McCluskey gave the Glenavon keeper Dylan Brake absolutely no chance. Dungannon off to a flyer, 1 0 after three minutes. More Dungannon pressure followed and this lovely pass from Noah Grimes set up Ethan Nethery who tested Dylan Brake. Only a minute later Dungannon set up a counter-attacking move. A lovely pass forward from Kenny Jimenez set up Corey Smith but the keeper saved well. Great play down the left wing allowed Dungannon to score their second goal. This lovely interchange allowed Corey Smith to double the lead. 2-0 after 19 minutes. This piece of brilliance by Matthew Quinn on the edge of the box led to the next opportunity for Dungannon a game which they were really dominating at this stage. Dungannon's third goal did arrive before half-time. Captain Kenny Jimenez heading home from a Matthew White corner. Jimenez was dictating play for Dungannon and this fantastic ball into the box set up a header opportunity for Ethan Nether. Into the second half now with Glenavon trailing 3-0 and some midfield pressure allowed them a chance to swing the ball into the box. Mark Davison's free kick ended up in the net and gave the Lurgan Blues some hope. Good pressure in midfield allowed another opportunity for Dungannon. Jimenez winning the ball back before shooting just wide of the left post. Glenavon the then attacked down the left wing, but this cross come shot didn't give the Dungannon defence too much to worry about. A poor goal kick was punished in a ruthless fashion when Colonel McGarrigal fired into the top corner to see the progress into the next round. Full time at finish, Granavan 1, Dungannon Youth 4. I thought we were off to a very good start. We got a quick early goal, um, a great stake from Dar McCluskey. Um, I thought our positional play was very good. We held a good shape and pressed well to win the ball back. Sometimes we played very great uh, positional play. Um, there was three or four really good passages to play, some good goals scored. Um, I thought maybe a bit in the second half we give the ball away a bit too easy in the final third. Just trying to play that quick ball too early, you know. Um, but overall, we were very happy with the result and very happy to get through the next round. I thought it was a tough game for the boys. Um, we have five or six players out this week uh, with a, an under 12 and under 11 playing for us. Um, so all in all, I thought um, we struggled probably in the first half to get the hold of their midfield. Very strong players in midfield. Uh, and then Gannon moved the ball really quickly, really well, lots of movement. So it took our guys just a while to work that out. Uh, and I thought we, we, they, they, pl they really did um, play much better than as the first 20 minutes but then after that I thought we, we came into the game and, and competed and got ourselves organised and, and made it a bit more of an even game second half certainly. Yeah, 